Rated PG-13. What's up, guys? Little Edge Gamer here, and we are playing the Sell Away, the Selling Simulator. And I was just singing Christopher Cross Selling, and I realized I forgot to hit the record button. So I'm not going to sing it again, I promise. I don't want to hurt anybody's ears out there. But again, Sell Away, the Selling Simulator, it's not sponsored by Christopher Cross in any way, shape, or form. They do have career scenarios in here. Cheers to everybody on stream. And everybody's saying cheers because I just told everybody to say cheers before I hit the record button since we got wine on board. So we're already a little bit toasty today. So the good thing is they the very first challenge is your first trip, which is very fitting. Uh, simple point to point to get the hang of the tiller. The boat is set to auto sell, so all you have to do is steer. Estimated time is 10 minutes. Estimated distance is one nautical mile. Let's go ahead and start it up because I know you guys are tired of me talking on the live stream. All right, simply cross the start line, go around the buoys the correct way, and cross the finish line. The boat is on auto sub mode, all you have to do is steer. Okay, all right. Relatively calm waters. I know there's, this actual game's still in early access, so they're working on the graphics a little bit. I don't have to adjust the cells, which is definitely good. I don't know how to change the view. Oh, there you go. That changes it. Oh, I don't want that view. There we go. There's a view changer right there. SV Sadie right there. That's the name of my boat. And uh, I don't see where to go. I'm not going to lie. I have to go on that side of the buoy, I'm assuming. I really can't see with the cells in front of me, which is a little bit annoying. There has to be a different view than this, though, right? Yeah, there we go. So I think I just have to go around that buoy as far as I can tell. We're definitely in a monohull. You can see boats out of San Antonio, Texas, which is good. I can actually look at the map, which is good too. I'm assuming since the arrow, if you look at the map, the arrow is pointing on this side of the buoy. As long as I go around it, I should be okay, right? I think that's what it's saying. Hopefully. It's timing me, which really sucks. I thought this was going to be a relaxing one nautical mile. Let me zoom in a little bit. Uh, as far as I can go in. I think the buoy's right there. There it is. <laughs> I'm already seasick. Yeah, test flight, this is definitely a thing, man. We are sailing right now. Ooh. For some reason, everything's backwards as far as how the mouse works when you're moving around. I'm getting a little seasick being sideways, though, I'm not going to lie. Oh, oh, what am I doing? I'm going the wrong way. Turn back around. I thought I had to turn around. I don't have to turn around. I need to go back down this way. Which, what is our... Uh, Speed is 5.5 .5 kilometers. True wind speed 16, which is really good. There we go. Now we're cruising. 6.5 on the speed is actually pretty decent for a sailboat. Hmm. 
<laughs> Ronaldo's Ronaldo is greater than Drogba. We all know that test flight. However, Drogba is going to be playing San Antonio FC this Saturday night. And I am destined to get Drogba's signature. I don't think I've ever been starstruck, but I feel like if Drogba came up to me and signed my jersey, I'd be pretty starstruck. Uh, Red Devil, I have tried Euro and World Ship Sim. So yes, I do have both of those. I also have Extreme Ship Simulator um, and a few other ones as well. I even have some like indie uh, ship simulators. Some are really good. Most of them are really horrible. I hate to say that. <laughs> White meat it is now. White meat is 100% correct. This is definitely a thing right now. No, I don't think... Chelsea's in the running. Did they actually win already? I haven't actually followed them in the past few weeks. So Test Flight said yes. Hell yeah. Finally, my, ten, my team finally won the championship, and I didn't even watch it all year. It's so sad. I'm not a true Chelsea fan, am I? Yeah, I didn't even know that. That's so sad. I call myself a true fan, and I had no clue they won the title. Almost makes me want to cry inside. Almost. Alright, here we go. Next buoy. I think we've sailed probably a half a nautical mile so far. Ooh. Did we just jib or job? I don't know. Alright, we passed the uh, second marker right there. And I think we're heading to the uh, finish line up here is what it looks like. Yeah, test flight. For me, it's just I can't get up that early. I absolutely hate mornings in a lot of the games here in the States, or at least uh, Central Standard Time. It comes on at like 6 a.m. in the morning. So unless I, unless I remember to record it like the night before, I'll never catch the game. Oh, man, he's going to the uh, Europa League final. I didn't know that. That's cool. Make sure I get lined up properly here. Yeah, nice little view. Pretty calm seas today as well. Makes this a relatively easy mission. I hate mornings. I'm so grumpy unless I have my coffee in the morning too. It's horrible. Falible. This might actually be the easiest mission I've ever played. And the most relaxing by the way. Cool thing is you can look around in each view, which is always nice. My, my time on this is probably absolutely horrid, though. I'm not going to lie. So 7.44. There we go. Don't you know? 